Welcome to Grumpy Guy Gaming and it's finally uh, an update on the Horus Heresy all the armies and everything we've done sorry for now not so being frequent I did do a lot of stuff I did a lot of assembly of the models just I don't know why I didn't record any updates uh, I'll try to do more frequent ones especially when I, uh, if I paint something or assemble something and we'll I'll slowly start talking about each legion and what I think of it, uh, the story about it, and that's it. We'll see uh, what's been going on now since Adam and I decided to uh, go heavy on the Horus Heresy because of the new edition that just came was announced. Uh, Adam decided to go with uh, Imperial Fists and Raven Guard. Most of it was already in storage, waiting to for somebody insane enough to work on them. Uh, I was working on my managed to get a very cheap uh, Tigmata army, so I primed that, assembled that. It was a little bit damaged, so I still have to repair some of the models. Uh, I worked on uh, a small f force of uh, cult box. I didn't want to do a separate army uh, to incorporate it into my dead guard or a new army. So I decided to take one of the cult sets and actually paint it up as the set itself. Uh, so the ultramarines and the world bearers, which is great. Uh, but then I realize I have spare uh, spare models lying around from the other cult set and uh, how to say mm, burning of Prospero so I decided to go with uh, make like a bigger force for the ultramarines which I'll talk when we come to the table uh, for the world bearers I had also same thing so I just combined everything together uh, what else? There's still stuff I need to assemble. Uh, I started painting the Imperial Fists. Uh, also my Dead Guard. I painted some models. And what else? I think that's it. I, I don't know what else. Also started a small force of Night Lords. Since I had some models lying around. I had a commission that I had to do but the guy just uh, bailed in the middle of it haven't heard from him ever since for two, three years did send emails but I was left with the models so sorry uh, what else what else uh, we're going to probably do soon uh, a small uh, battle report for Horus Heresy. Uh, I just need to finish up for Adam some tactical marines. So he has the Imperial Fist. I'll probably play with the Dead Guard. Or I might surprise him with Tegmata. But we'll see if I manage to paint that up. I still have a lot of work from other people for commissions and everything. And that's it. Now guys, it's not so interesting this one. I'll try to do the next one planet a little bit better. Maybe a little bit lower for each legion that we are collecting. Uh, we'll see. Maybe even tactic videos when the new Horus Heresy comes out. Uh, I need to get Adam here so we can record some uh, his opinions about his army and what he thinks. We'll see. Uh, also, since this is Horus Heresy, uh, I'll be the next one we'll be also working on the Titan Adeptus Titanicus Horus Heresy hopefully if I manage if we manage not I uh, we might incorporate the two battles more narrative plays so Titanicus and uh, Horus Heresy itself maybe someday go, go battle gothic epic we'll see uh, the idea, for instance, for battle report between Titanicus and, let's say, standard for, for Horus Heresy 
is uh, for instance we play a Titanicus game each turn represents the same turn with the uh, with the force that's battling on the on the side well, for instance Imperial Fist against that guard and then if we decide on one part of the table this is going to be the zone that they're going to be fighting we're on and if something happens like, like a grenade uh, the Titan blast comes to that part we'll simulate like a scatter of the explosion itself but we're still tweaking the rules it won't be how to say fair you could get fuck you could get a, like a volcano cannon on your whole army at some point but hey, that's war we're still tweaking it uh, a little bit uh, i think that's it I, knew that. I haven't planned this correctly but definitely <laughs> leave a comment uh, tell her i suck definitely uh what else now let's go to the table and I'll talk to you about the units that's been done that's how we know progress and everything let's go and this is what we've been I've been working on so we have imperial fists so let's see what we get what's painted unpainted so let's go with the tacticals and then with the paints we have 30 tacticals ready to be painted primed and then painted we have a scar and punisher is it punisher or something like that then we have a is it fell blade or falchion I, I forgot this name sorry uh, what else do we have we have some terminators with storm shields we have fafnir assembled i think this one i showed last time Box. we have a Praetor here, we have a Command Group, a Banner and a Champion, a Cult Terminator, Captain, an Apothecarian, a Chaplain and a Mortet. For the, this is the Tagmata part, sorry for the unknown focus. And the Night Lords. For the Night Lords, I have uh, a Terminator Lord. Cataphracty arm. No, this is Phobos arm, I think. Uh, a unit of jump uh, marines and a Leviathan. Uh, then we have some characters for Tegmat. I forget the names. So they just have some crazy names. We have Tech Trolls, about 20 of them almost. Uh, we have Talax, 12 of them, we have Castellax, oh, these are, oh, fuck, I forgot these names, was, uh, Vorax, oh, these are Vorax, and this is, fuck, I don't know, Thanatars, yeah, so we get two of them, bases will be uh, more uh, rubble, so urban ones, then we have the Raven Guards. So for the Raven Guard, we have an Apothecary, a Praetor, some Phobos Terminators, uh, Night Furies. I think they're Night Furies. We have 30 Tacticals or Veterans Squad. I think uh, they will use as Veterans. We have a limited edition uh, Land Speeder that he brought me last. A uh, couple of last week, I think. Uh, some land speeders. We have a Dawn, I don't know what's their name. Uh, Dawn, blah, 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 blah. We have some Graviton guns. We have some uh, Rhinos for the veteran squads. Here I finished my Dead Guard, some uh, Rapier Quad mortars or whatever they're called. Uh, a rhino to transport them and for the word bearers we have Praetor in Terminator armor chaplain uh, the special character with his blade sleeves I forgot Zeit 
Stone Zufon, whatever his name is. We have some Gal Warbuck. We have uh, 30 Tacticals. Wait, to be use it. No, 20 Tacticals, what I'm talking about. We have a Possessed Contemptor, a Standard Contemptor. Uh, what else do we have? We have some characters for Ultramarines. We have a Captain in Terminate, Cataphracty Armor. Uh, Chaplain, a limited edition uh, banner, some Phobos Terminators, some Cataphracty Terminators, a Devastator Squad with last cannons, eight Marines, I don't know where those two are, so I'll need to find somewhere to replace or make another two tacticals. We have a tactical squad here, we have a support squad with plasmas here, a uh, Contemptor with the Keris Assault Cannon and Power Fist and this uh, Vindicare Laser Destroyer, I think that's called. And that's what's been mostly done from the last update. You can see there was a lot of work, a lot of assembly, a lot of cleaning, basing. Uh, Hopefully for the next update, I might even have it next week, but we'll see. We'll have either some Imperial Fists finished, maybe Ultras, we'll see. Uh, Dead Guard, mostly done. Uh, except the troops and everything I have. Raven Guard, well, there's a shitload of work on them. Uh, I think the Tagmata list will be the fastest one that I can finish, not too much details, mostly the armor panels. And metallics, Night Lords, I'll leave it alone for a while. And that's it. Uh, leave a comment below, tell me what you think. Subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber. Hit the bell button to get notifications and upload a new video. And thank you for watching. And stay grumpy.